told you about the second oldest Pearl Harbor survivor, retired Lieutenant Jim Downing. He witnessed history over 70 years ago, and now he wrote about it in his book, The Other Side of Infamy. Cardio News Channel 13's Cynthia Maldonado was at his book signing, which had a surprising turnout. The Other Side of Infamy is a front row seat to a world of war. 103 year old Lieutenant Jim Downing faced the flames of a man made hell and Japanese planes raining down on the U.S. I've had a very adventuresome life for 103 years. And uh, I've been around the world three times. I've lived in six places in the world, including uh, South America and England. All these were adventures. It's a recollection that avid readers knew they had to read. The book is fantastic. His memory is fantastic. His recall, his descriptions, it's absolutely wonderful. And to meet a, to meet a Pearl Harbor vet uh, is, is fantastic. The other side of infamy caught the attention of many. Amongst the 200 that showed up at the book signing was 12-year-old Eric White. It's really amazing how he can tell everything that happened, how he remembers everything perfectly, even what he did that morning before the attack, and tell it so it's like that you were there watching. Locals weren't the only ones showing support. One close friend of Lieutenant Downing stopped by to testify. My friend lives that out, and he's done it for years. I admire Jim for maintaining his life well beyond whatever the normal retirement is. Although today's weather wasn't the best to be outside, many didn't mind waiting in a long line. The Pearl Harbor survivor greeted all of his fans, smiled, and took pictures. Because of all who gathered today in support, Lieutenant Jim Downing says he's one happy author. All right, thank you, Cynthia. 215 people showed up today's book signing. You can find The Other Side of Infamy on Amazon for about $13. Lieutenant Downing will be at Pearl Harbor for its 75th anniversary this December. Donald